So guys, welcome back to another episode of the Liverpool Camera Mode, and finally we are we are back into four games an episode. And in this episode, we have four games. We have uh, Bournemouth coming up. We have Leicester City coming up, and then the transfer window is closed. And then we have uh, West Brom and Stoke. So we have uh, I I don't know. I haven't looked about. Uh, I haven't looked on the team. But I think neither of these teams have made uh, big signings, which means it should be a quite easily, uh, for, uh, a quite easy, easily we are gonna come away with at least three wins in this episode. Uh, first off is Bournemouth, and uh, I don't know. We have been having an easy time against Bournemouth. We are at Anfield as well. Some teams have been playing two games already, and uh, Arsenal and Hull City is actually on uh, full points. Leicester City has also played two games, and they are on four points. Newcastle is up there as well on four points. Uh, but we have uh, this team for the first game, Coutinho, Suarez, Mane, uh, Campbell, Perea, Wijnaldum, Moreno, Matip, Hummels, and Klein. And then Carries in goal, Hummels making his debut for Liverpool in this game. Alright guys, the first uh, home game for this season, we are at Anfield, we're going to play Bournemouth, Hummels is making his debut in the defence there, and now I feel solid again, like, now I feel like we have a solid defence, I don't have to worry about anything in the back there, and oh shit, that was a really weak shot, and we have of course, as we had in the last season as well, the best attack in the Premier League. Suarez takes the ball right away here. He's gonna keep that ball. He's gonna pass it to Coutinho, and as I said, we have the best the f we have the best attack in the league. Suarez takes the ball. He passed it to Coutinho, who bangs it right away. One 0 Liverpool, and that's a two-man job. What the hell was that? Jaldem, oh, great ball to Luis Suarez. He's gonna finish that two 0 Suarez picks up his second goal after two games in the Premier League. Two 0 Liverpool. Decent stuff there, assisted by whoever, who else? Wijnaldum. Second goal for Suarez. Can he pick up uh, 30 goals in the season as well? It would be great if he could. Danilo Perea, oh, Coutinho. So much space for Felipe Coutinho there. He makes his second goal of this game. Why is no one marking Coutinho there? 3 0 Liverpool. Look at this. He, he, he has to stand completely open here. No one. Not even a single one is marking him. No one is even close to him. Coutinho scores his second game or second goal of this game. 3-0 after half time. Or before half time. This Bournemouth. You're gonna get relegated if you keep playing like this. Oh Kevin Campbell, nice run by him. Sadio Mane, 4-0. Yes, easily done. 4-0. Bournemouth has nothing to come up with here. We have the best attack in the Premier League. 4-0. Sadio Mane picks up his first goal. And this actually uh, gives some pressure to uh, Quincy Proms. Because he didn't do that much in his uh, first game. And there goes the final whistle. We get a 4-0 victory. And uh, I was pretty concerned in the... Uh, after the Chelsea game that we didn't do much. Oh no, I forgot about I forgot, uh, I forgot about looking at the stats. My bad. Uh, we, I, I was kind of concerned about the first uh, game because we didn't do that much. We needed a penalty to win, but now we go on and score four goals against uh, Bournemouth. All right, the second game of this episode is it's a game against Leicester City. They are on sixth place after two games played. They have four points. We have six points after two games played. We also have uh, Suarez and Coutinho on uh, third and fourth place in the. Oh, wait, what? He's a left back. He's a left back. How the hell can Luke Shaw has three goals? That, what? All right, Luke Shaw somehow has three goals. Uh, we're gonna keep the same team. Uh, the only difference is that I'm not gonna play Karius because I'm actually gonna play Minjula in this game. Just for the just for some time, he's not gonna be a starting one, but he's gonna play a little bit. And I also want my youngster Kisie on the bench, as well as Milner. Uh, James Milner is in as well, instead for Bran again. So we have a decent team now. I need to make a backup team as well, which I'm gonna do off screen, I think. 
Who's Juarez right away? Is Juarez gonna score? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, 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 he is. Again, an early goal by Luis Juarez. Three and a half minutes into the uh, into this game, we get a goal. And Luis Juarez, he's he's getting older, but still he can still score goals. Assisted by who else? Felipe Coutinho. These two has a really good form right now. They're probably the best players in the Premier League, except for Luke Shaw. He's been having a decent season as well. He somehow has picked up three goals in two games. Cut back. Perea. Score that. 2 0. Is it Winjaldum? Yes, it is. Jinji. Uh, I don't know. Is he name? Is his name? Is his first name uh, Jinji? I don't know. Well, we get a goal. 2 0. And Coutinho sets that up. He passed it to Danilo, who lays it off to Winjaldum, who banks that as Michael can't do much. Michael is a really good keeper, but when the defense is just standing there doing nothing, not even not even him can, or not even he can say that. To to be honest, like him. That was better. It's Juarez. Oh, Kevin Campbell, three 0 He's back as well now. Kevin Campbell. What a goal, three 0 Liverpool. And uh, I don't know if you noticed there. But uh, looks like Bayern Munich has replaced Hummels already with uh, Laporte. Kevin Campbell picks up his first goal for the Premier League uh, this season. But, like, come on. We're going to win the league again. Luis Suarez to Winjaldum. I see Coutinho with a lot of space here. Coutinho. Oh, he squeezes through. He gets a goal as well. This kid is so tiny that he can, he can squeeze through every little gap. Look at this skill move here. Squeezes through two players, gets his second goal of this game. Felipe Coutinho, what a goal. 4 0. No, he's not. What? Who scored the other goals? Wait a minute. I thought he had two. Play that to Felipe Coutinho, he's going to finish that, 5-0, Coutinho can score from every angle there is, 5-0. Assisted by Wijnaldum, but this is too easy, 4 goals now by Felipe Coutinho. In total, nothing this match, he's second in this game. Holy shit, 5-0, we've scored 9 goals, oh, don't do that Perea. We have scored five. Or we have scored. Uh, can't speak. We have scored nine goals in two games. Ten in three. We could concede one as well. Slimani scored a goal. That was a really decent free kick. Minjole misread that really badly, and we conceded our first goal. Five-one in the 90th minute, but still a decent victory, an easy victory. Three new points, and this time I'm gonna take a look at the stats. Three shots, one on target by Leicester, and, they, and he went in. Really? Mignolet, really? Twelve shots, nine on target by us, and then we have... Uh, Winjaldum actually picks up the man on the match with a 9.6. Suarez with an 8.8, .8, Mane with a 7.1, Campbell with a 9.4, 9.5 on Coutinho. Coutinho two goals, Campbell one, Suarez one, Winjaldum one. Winjaldum with three assists, uh, Perea with one and Coutinho with one. So Coutinho picked up uh, two goals and one assist. Winjaldum picked up one goal and three assists. All right, guys, there have some uh, been some changes in uh, the starting um, or in the starting in the calendar, uh, which means we have to start our backup team in this game uh, against West Brom because we have uh, only four days later we have a game against uh, Borussia Mönchengladbach in the Premier League which means I want my strongest team there so I'm gonna play a different squad I'm gonna make it off screen as well right now so you're not, you're not gonna see it uh, I'm gonna have to make a second squad here I don't know how I make a second squad how do I make a second squad because I don't want to change every single player out uh, team sheet maybe don't know Alright guys, for the home game against West Brom, we have made a second team, and the second team looks like this. We have Origi up top as the striker, we have Proms uh, playing uh, uh, right wing. Then we have Markovic playing left wing, and he actually is a re uh, right wing, which is not ideal, but it's going to have to work out. We have Grusic, we have Evren Shan, Kessier, uh, Sam Byram, Nelson Lindelof, 
uh, Clavan, Milner and Minjule. So we have a decent team here. Uh, the reason why I'm playing Minjule over uh, over Karius, even though the keeper doesn't really have to be a second team player, is that I don't want to uh, get an uh, injury on uh, Karius, because I don't know, we really need Karius. So let's jump into this game against West Brom and see how the second team will perform. Remember guys that these are players that I'm usually not playing at all. We signed the uh, Kassie, but oh, we pick up an injury right away. Uh, Grusic injured uh, right away, not ideal. We're gonna have to play... Uh, let's play Winjaldum. So we pick... This, this is why I wanted to play with my second team, because I didn't want to risk uh, getting an injury with on my starting 11 like think about it like that could have been Kevin Campbell or Coutinho or even Suarez Sam Byram of all people what is he doing up here should have went for a finesse shot by the way and not a full power shot because that was not good by Byram referee penalty how the hell is that not a penalty a nil nil draw against Bournemouth no, against West Brom, I meant. Oh, this team. The second team picked up a lot of chances. Nine shots, five on target. We won possession as well, but we couldn't score. And we are yet to concede a goal. Nil, nil. Holy shit, we played bad. Milner gets the man on the match. How many chan How many shots How many shots did? Mark, we had two shots. Should have scored them as well, but he didn't. Alright, guys, I have some bad news that isn't really that important but we can forget about uh, uh, Marco Grusic he's out for seven months seven months injury so he's out and he's gonna be out for pretty much the entire season which is not good but he, he's not a player that get, getting a lot of uh, uh, playing time anyway so I don't know but we have the game against the uh, um, uh, Borussia Mönchengladbach now and I play four games an episode you know that by now I play four games an episode I have played two games this episode no I played three games this episode which means this game is actually the one that's gonna be simulated but I don't know shit I'm act now I'm actually gonna simulate this one I'm sim I'm simulating the game against uh, Borussia Mönchengladbach. It's our first uh, Premier League or it's our first uh, Champions League game ever with uh, Liverpool. But I'm gonna simulate the first one. We are at home. I'm gonna simulate this one because I'm I'm bound to play f or play three games, simulate one every single episode. So I'm gonna simulate this one and see what happens. We have the strongest team possible. We have the the main team with Minjule in goal though. Uh, come on, we pick up a win. Campbell with a goal. 89th minute, he scores a goal. He knows how to score a goal against uh, the Bundesliga teams. So we get a, uh, a comfortable 1-0 victory there. and uh, Which means we are through. And we have to play the backup team against, uh, against Stoke. Which is not good. The backup team against Stoke is not going to be a good idea, but it's going to be in the next episode. We have dropped down to second place with 10 points after four games. We are still looking good in every single angle. The backup team needs some work. Suarez is starting to score goals. Coutinho, I think, is topping the goal scoring league. Yes, he is with four goals. Uh, the same with uh, Slimani. Suarez has three goals. And as, again, there aren't many uh, strikers up there. Coutinho is up there. Casola, uh, Townsend, Barkley, Tawin. I don't think Olive Oliveira is a striker either. So we only have two strikers up there. Slimani and Suarez. Which is kind of weird. Where is Ibra? Uh, right, Ibra might have retired. But where is, uh, like, where is Costa? Where are all those players? It doesn't make sense. But we're going to end this episode here. We played a decent uh, game. We played four games. We got four wins. We conceded only one goal, which was against Leicester. Slimani scored that goal. And uh, 
yeah if you have enjoyed this video leave a like let's get this video to five likes and if you're new to my channel as well remember to hit that subscribe button i will see you guys later with another video